Alright, you found my new video, so me and Sai are just chilling before we actually uh, make, yes. make the video. And I wanted to say to you, Black Shook. What do you know about Black Shook? Black Shook? It's a cryptid. It is. It's... Oh, that's a... <laughs> Oh, I'll tell you what, into, uh, into memories. Yeah, uh, I tell you what I heard about it. Darkness, first album, the first sing, the first track is called Black Shook. Black Shook. Oh, it's about a black dog. It is a shaggy it's dog, like a, like a, a hound of the Baskerville yeah. type of. Yeah. yeah. And then today I heard mention of it in another cryptid podcast. There you go. And um, yeah, so it's one of those mythical dogs that runs. Well, it said where it ran around. And it pretty much went moorlands, woodlands, but then in towns, in graveyards, it's like it's seen all over, I want to say Wolverhampton, but I don't think it is, down, down south. Um, Black country, Midlands. Yeah, I don't know, maybe that's what I thought. Uh, I can't remember. We can look it up. A little bit, yeah. But, um, Black yeah, basically. I don't know where I read it at. Yeah, it's a famous... It it's is probably the, the, the only. Oh no, I'd have heard of Loch Ness. But yeah, that's one of the very few odd animals I've heard of. And then, um, you're telling a story about it. Most people are saying it's like a mastiff, it's a dog. But then you get other accounts saying it was more wolf like. Mm -hmm. But the tail that was on the, on the podcast was it was eight foot. And it, this woman was getting assaulted almost by a, a weird guy following her in a foggy back street. Um, and this black, black shook. shook came out and sort of, she ran off and it attacked him. Eight foot. It's a massive, yeah, I can, it, I think it's one of these, it's almost like, I think like a shape changing. Like well, it that. has to be, doesn't yeah. it? If everyone would, was saying that. But the podcaster was saying... It probably comes from Viking law. Tell you where it was. Yeah, it's East East Anglia, and that's right, where okay. they came to. And because a black dog or something represented the god Odin. Odin. And so if they brought over this mythos, it kind of perpetuates. So Odin had two ravens as well. Not quite sure, but it was interesting. Yeah. I just wondered if you were had jumped on that train. I have heard of the black shirt. <laughs> Tell you what I have heard of as well, recently I've been doing a bit more reading. There's been a lot more sightings of um, werewolf type creatures or dogs that walk on rear legs and yeah. things like that. And yeah. <clears throat> put them down to like, I don't know, so in America they call them a skin change, do they, or something oh, yeah. like that, a werewolf. Yeah. But there's been a lot more in this country recently yeah. than... You know, forever really. I saw a good video on Facebook of a dog that had taught itself to walk on its hind legs. I've seen that, yeah. It's like, that is awesome, but it, freaky, just, isn't it? just it? looks weird, doesn't yeah. it? It just looks very strange. Mm. But it's when they're running outside of cars and things and keeping up with them. It's, yeah. That's the weird thing. Yeah. So, yeah, that was it really, that little yeah. bonus. Yeah, little bonus the black shirt. Yeah, look, have a look at that. Yeah. yeah. Right, thanks for watching the video, and uh, see you uh, I'll get the coffee. Yeah.